What's up guys, Mike here. Now before I start the video, I just wanted to tell you guys about a really, really, really cool app out there called Minecraft Amino. Now basically, this is an app available for iOS and Android that allows you to join various Minecraft and other communities. The app provides you with a newsfeed of content such as chats, polls, challenges, tutorials, videos and things like that. So if you guys have any kind of interest in servers or builds or anything else Minecraft related, make sure to download this app and this app is definitely for you. Another cool feature the app has is the fact that you guys can actually join different public chats like you're seeing on screen now with YouTubers, the end lovers, Minecraft animations. So basically you can join the chat by clicking join and you'll be able to talk to the various people that are in the chat. Just within a couple seconds of me going through the app, I can see a variety of different content. For example, how to make Minecraft renders, MCPE challenges, um, more kind of builds, videos shaded skins, things like that, even a server over here you can go ahead and join. So as you can see there's a lots and lots of variety of different content for you guys to choose from. If you guys do get the app, I highly suggest you guys following me on the app at MCPE Mike. that is my username. If you guys want to go ahead and make your own posts and polls and things like that, all you have to do is click the button in the bottom right hand corner. You'll be given a selection of six different things to choose from. Examples of blogs, links, favorites, polls, questions and public chats. Once you guys have made friends on the community, don't be shy to actually start a private chat with one of your friends. This way you can keep up to date with your friends list on the app. So guys, with all that being said, hope to see you on the app. Let's move on with the video. What's up guys, Mike here, welcome back to another Minecraft Pocket Edition video. Today I'm joined by Aniski007 or MCPE Redstone. What is up dude? Sup man, long time no see, it's been a while. It has been Since a while. A collaboration thingy. Yep, it indeed has, but uh, we're doing something really really cool today. It's actually a glitch slash bug slash trick. Um, so can you explain a bit about it, Aniski? Okay, I only know about this glitch for 5 minutes, but I will explain it to you in immense detail. So basically, this glitch is a glitch which allows multiple people to ride a single horse, which is just fantastic, to cruise over all the biomes and yes. all the maps. So pretty much, so. this trick is used to make like two people go on a horse to like, I don't know, it's more efficient than one person. No, what are you doing? What are you doing with the TNT, Aniski? What are you doing? Uh, relax. It's it's a trust game. It's a trust game. Okay, fine. Okay, fine. <laughs> Just get my horse away. Just get my horse away from it. Okay, anyway. So basically how the glitch works is one person gets onto the horse. So Aniski. Step you one. Go on the horse. Step two. He has to exit the game. And the person that goes on the horse should be the one that is is not hosting the world. Yes, so it's my just, world. Just so Aniski is mind. player number one who gets onto so the horse. I go out of the world. Then I get onto the horse, and then he joins back. Are you on the horse, then I shall join back. I am locating the, lo the, locating the server. Yes. And as you can see, building the terrain. He's on my horse with me. It's kind of weird, kind of glitchy, but still pretty cool. So right now, I'm actually the only one who can move around with the horse, and he's just a passenger. But yeah. Yee. So that's actually that, and. This glitch can possibly happen with more than two people, so we're probably going to test that out real quick and get like three or four people on, see if that works, and we'll be right back. Alright guys, now we're testing it out with three people. As you can see, Aniski has brought along his second account. I don't know what he's doing over there. <laughs> but, um, okay, let's try it out. Aniski, okay. um, take a seat. controlling two devices at once. It's, it's, it's totally easy. Okay. okay, so, first of all, I will go on the horse, and then I disconnect, right? Yep, then you disconnect, and then you join and with then other I go accounts. on the horse again. And then you disconnect again. And then I disconnect again. And then I go onto the horse, and then you join and back. now I'm gonna, going to join back as soon as I can. And hopefully, if everything goes right, we should have locating server, building terrain. No way, it's terrain. working. It's working, man. It's working. Yeah, it's working. Oh yeah. no! Oh. No! Oh. No! Oh man! Oh, oh man! Uh, it's it's not stable enough. No, you guys fell off. Oh well. So as you can, but it does work for <laughs> yeah. a small while. <laughs> yeah, it does work for like five seconds, and then it crashes or like I don't know, glitches out. But that was pretty much it for the video, guys. Getting two people 
onto one horse. If you guys enjoyed the video, please do drop a like and subscribe to me and Aniski as well. I'll leave his channel in the description below. But thanks, guys, anyway, for watching. See you guys next wait, time. Wait, 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 wait. We need to end off strong. Yeah. No, my horse, my horse, my horse. It's fine. He died. Anyways, guys, see you next time. And. Oh, what? Oh, there we go. Cheers.